Hello, homie chefs. Welcome back to Nana Kitchen. So, people have been tagging me to this viral cucumber stew. And I watched the video of this lady that made the stew with these cucumbers and I decided to try it out, guys. So, I bought this pepper, this dried up pepper, soaked it with hot water, and I'm washing it just because of scarcity of tomatoes in the market. So, this is what we'll be using to make this. Uh, delicious cucumber stew that is trendy right now so you called and i'm ready to deliver <laughs> okay wash please wash because of outbreak of cholera in lagos please make sure you wash your products your food products bought from the market please wash very well so now i'm transferring to the blender and this is me trying to enjoy myself while i'm working because ah who are who i be with the stress of the market i need to enjoy myself why i cook because this nigeria this lagos is straight for to stress you so this is me just trying to you know do some ube to pair to enjoy myself while i am cooking so this is over to the blender is blended this is it all smooth with my beautiful blender and <laughs> i'm enjoying it look at the, the pepper it's just pepper only nothing else just that dried up pepper that soaked with hot water and this me washing my cucumber again i bought three large cucumbers i think this was one thousand for three of them and so people usually um to remove the back the green part of their cucumber but i decided not to do it because the lady i watched did not remove hers so i just made sure i bought a little bit of ripe ones so that it is not bitter in this too so i tested it to make sure it was not bitter that's why i didn't remove the back side so i've blended it. it is a consistency you get after blending so this is it i've blended it and i'm sieving it out with my sieve to remove the water from the cucumber mixture and this is it this is what you get after you sieved it out so dry this is the water i drank it later it was just normal just like normal water just a little bit of taste so i drank i enjoyed the water actually it was just like juice or something Guys, so over let's to go and cook it and enjoy it this is onion please remember to always fry your herbs in your stew it brings out the flavor perfectly fry your herbs fry your curry together with your onion it brings out a delicious taste in your food so i'm going to be using ginger tin tomatoes to complete this recipe and this is the blended pepper i've poured it in after i've made sure our tea tomatoes have fried for a bit so in with our tomatoes our blended pepper turn it mix it as the oil is separated from the tomatoes and it's all cooked perfectly i add the cucumber into the stew and i'm just you know at this point i was like are you sure you want to do this but people said it's nice so i had to try it can't be left alone in this trend so all done all boiled well i'm adding a paprika white pepper please this white pepper is very essential in your kitchen if you don't have it please buy it that's ginger powder added ginger powder garlic powder in the stew and this is our no cubes adding no cubes to our stew a little bit of salt just to complete the beautiful taste and look at it um you, you won't even see any bit of green anything in this too it has all blended together oh my this stew was 10 over 10 over nothing the stews in this stew it is top notch the stew is the stew is just it's just overwhelming it is stews over stews over stews over 100 over 100 stews look at this stew oh my this stew People that came to my house during this period did not even know this was cucumber stew that I served them. There was no difference. You would just love it. It made sense and I enjoyed it over and over and over again. This too, please, I need you guys to try it. If you have not yet followed this page, please do because I drop back-to-back -back recipes every Saturday. So this is me just trying to check out the stew again and make sure that it is what it is and it is what it is the seeds of this stew it is top notch seeds is hundred look at that stew once once again and it's looking so yummy i enjoy this too please do yours and enjoy it too thank you